guys, what is up? CJB back again with another reaction for you. I was going to say trailer reaction, but it's not really a trailer. It might be. It could be a couple trailers. I don't know what it's going to be. However, tonight we are watching the Yacht Club Presents presentation on G4. So I didn't know this was happening until like midnight last night. Um, but it's 6 p.m. Eastern time uh, over on G4's Twitch. They are doing a presentation for Yacht Club Games. There's no real specificity as to what is going to be here, whether it's uh, new games, updates on... Uh, I don't know what else we have knowledge of of Yacht Club right now. I know we've had Shovel Knight Dig. Um, we, uh, sorry, we had Shovel, Shovel Knight Pocket Dungeon, and we have Shovel Knight Dig over the horizon. Um, I don't know what else is to come from Yacht Club. Uh, so hopefully today we see something cool. Listen, you could show me anything Shovel Knight. I'm going to be excited. Um, maybe some DLC for Cyber Shadow. Probably some new IPs. We don't know. This, uh, this could be cool. And if it's something that's not particularly exciting, I get to watch it myself and I just don't upload this. So who knows? But yes, I have, I love Yacht Club. Super excited. Um, but yeah, for now, while I have about uh, 10 minutes before the whole thing gets started, I'm just going to sit here and watch Adam Sessler answer your questions about Kingdom Hearts 3. So uh, see you guys in a minute. So uh, uh, coming up next... We have more from Yacht Club Games, go, so stay baby. tuned. We have some reveals you don't want to miss it. The Yacht Club Games present is happening next. Don't go anywhere. Dog, if I see don't anything do Shovel Knight, I'll lose my mind. I'll lose my mind. Welcome to Yo, end the ad. End the ad. Lexus NX. There's still 10 seconds. I swear to God, if this event starts while, while I'm looking at a cage and a Lexus, I'm going to lose my mind. No, Gerard, come back. Come on. That sounds like music from The Messenger. Welcome back it might be Cyber Club. Shadow, though. This is the moment we've been teasing all show. This year's Yacht Club Games presents an official update from Yacht Club Games, including a brand new, huge world premiere exclusive announcement presented by X-Play. Turn down the lights, grab your show my plushies and amiibos, because here we go. I didn't grab my amiibos. They're on the wall and I don't want to get up. That's an awesome logo. Might still have for the thumbnail instead. <laughs> Hello, I'm Sean Velasco designer at Yacht Club Games. We're an independent game developer based in Los Angeles, California. Back in 2013, we got our start when we I launched love a Kickstarter campaign for Shovel Knight, our groundbreaking debut title that fused modern gameplay with retro sensibilities. Shovel Knight was a big my hit. favorite indie game, then, dude. We've been creating more adventures in the Shovel Knight series. Plague of Shadows, Spectre of Torment, King of Cards, and the multiplayer battler Shovel Showdown. Knight Showdown. As Yacht Club Games grew, we ventured into publishing. Our most recent release was 2021 Cyber Shadow. It's a good game. I haven't finished it, but it's a good game. It's hard. Games. We've also been working with our talented developer friends to co-develop innovative new titles like the recently released Shovel Knight Pocket Dungeon. So much fun. Well as the upcoming platforming adventure, Shovel Knight Dig. Can't wait like to try to it. Thank you to our legions of fans and friends. Your support is what allows us to live our dreams, and we will never forget that. Today, we have a lot of cool news to share with you. We'll be focusing on a selection of games that have brand new content currently in development. We have quite a few things to cover, so let's get started. Yeah, let's go. Okay, so Pocket Dungeon DLC. Or something. What? Oh, oh, okay, those were scores. I'm like, what is that? That was so many numbers. It's, oh man, it's so much fun. It's such a mindless, like, turn it off. I love Plague Knight. I love Propeller Knight. Um, and probably Shovel Knight, my three favorite ones to play. Okay, so you're just plugging it. Hey there, Pocketeers. My name is Celia Schilling. I'm the hey, marketing Celia. manager at Yacht Club Games. As you may know, our roguelike puzzler, Shovel Knight Pocket Dungeon, was released on December 13th for Nintendo Switch, PS4, and PC. We're only a month into release and already we are blown away hmm. by the glowing reception. Players everywhere are battling one another. I've yet to do any PvP, I don't know if that owns the game on Switch. And solving the Pocket Dungeon's many mysteries. A lot of creativity and hard work went into this game's three year development so far, but we're just getting started. We have a few announcements okay. for Shovel Knight Pocket Dungeon. Okay, what do you this got? What do you got? This update will add new accessibility options, bug fixes, and quality of life improvements. For instance, you can now control how much the board fills up when you fall in battle. Also, many objects That's cool. have been given new descriptive text, 
Almost every object in the game has also been given a portrait, even this puddle of lava. It will also include a new playable character, Random Knight. Oh. This mysterious combatant will appear in camp after you've already recruited a few knights. When you start a new adventure with Random Knight, he will randomly become one of your unlocked characters. Interesting. Random Knight is a great way to show off your knowledge of the That's whole That's kind of cool. Cast. This I don't have all the characters yet. Available soon. Next, we'd like to pull back the development curtain on our expansive slate of downloadable content that will be available in three what DLC packs. What do you got? They give me longevity for Pocket Dungeon? Developing online compatibility for Versus Mode. Okay. That's right. Soon, you'll be able to go head-to-head -head with your friends and other puzzlers around the world. There's plans Is there matchmaking? Can I queue with randos? Oh, perfect. You'll be able to find players of your skill level, improve your puzzle prowess to I'll give it a shot. I have to practice again. We're also mod support features Ooh. for the PC version of the game. With mod support, and trusted uh -huh. players will be able to add their own content to the game. We look forward to delving into your own original That's so creations fun. in the near future. <laughs> Many the other elements yet. are still in early development, but we're planning on releasing new playable characters, enemies and bosses, relics and items, hidden secrets, and much, much more. We'll be revealing more details about everything mentioned at a later date, so please hang tight, puzzlers. That's awesome. It's such a good game. I love Hi, Pocket Dungeon, I'm dude. I'm Sandy Gordon. I'm an artist at Yacht Club Games. We're working alongside Nitro on the brand new platforming adventure, Shovel Knight Dig. Today, we're thrilled to share more details about the game. In Shovel Knight Dig, you embark so on your pretty. Oh, it's so pretty. Drill Knight and his dastardly digging crew, the Hexcavators, blast apart your peaceful campsite and steal your loot. As you tunnel after him in chase, you'll collect gems and golden gear bits, procure powerful weapons, and take down foes, both familiar and new. Stages are procedurally generated, so make sure to keep your wit as sharp as your shovel. I love the art style. The fact that like three different Shovel Knight games exist and they all look different. I love it. Unlocked items carry over after you fall in battle. So grab as much treasure as possible and stock up on supplies before you start a new run. As you dig deeper, you'll discover that there's much more to this heist than it appears on the surface. At the end of each level, you'll encounter one of the nefarious excavators blocking your path. Wow. Today, we wanted to highlight the crafty collector. It's kind of like Plague Knight. Scrap Knight as overseer oh, okay. Okay. So, okay. so Scrap Knight's scrap in, in scrounges uh, for worthy value Pocket Dungeon. And keeps the truly special stuff slung wow. over her shoulder in an enormous bag. That's so familiar? dope. You might have spotted Scrap Knight as a playable character in Shovel Knight Pocket Dungeon. I Though did. she appeared in that game first, she was actually created for Shovel Knight Dig. Next, We'd like to present to you another new area you'll discover as you descend into the earth. Welcome to the bug-infested depths of the Grub Pit. Even if you're just passing through, these creepy crawlies don't Ew. take too kindly. <laughs> They're so gross. Make haste while digging through the carnivorous dirt. It will retaliate by releasing its deadly spikes. Other foes, Ooh. like the rolling Beedo, will roll toward you with giant balls of something. Yuck. That's poop, dog. Use your shovel drop to stay above the fray. When you reach the bottom of the nest, you'll encounter another member of the Hexcavator. Hive Knight. A certain bug-loving spelunker, perhaps? Though we needed a little more development time than we initially anticipated, we're excited to announce that the game is in the final stages of development and nearing completion. We look forward to sharing okay. Shovel Knight's next I was scared to death. He's going to be like, coming in February. Hey, let's go. I'm excited to see what they're bringing to it. Like I said, I never finished it. I got pretty close though. We played a good bit on stream the first night. Mm, right. So good. The game, not the sprite, but the sprite is also good. <laughs> It, was, it wasn't insanely funny like I, when I saw this game at first I thought it was kind of like the messenger um, and then it seemed to not really be uh, like it, it had a Hi, difficulty Warner, curve that messenger didn't Wars. have I don't think I'm anyway games. we can't believe it's already been a year since cyber shadow released it seems like just yesterday when fans were descending into Mecha City <laughs> and battling dr. Progen for the first time cyber shadow was developed as a love letter to action games of a classic era 
and it's been awesome to see players connecting with the game, finding all the secrets, and rising to its toughest challenges. If you haven't played Cyber Shadow, yo, that level was hard. Oh my god, that dragon! Epic ninja adventure. <sighs> because for a limited time, Cyber Shadow will be thirty percent off on all participating platforms. It's a good deal. Also. We're happy to announce that we are releasing Cyber Shadow's pulse-pounding soundtrack by the very talented composer Enrique Martin. It is available cool. digitally on Bandcamp starting today. And we'll be uh, I didn't see it sale on PlayStation, soon. though, on that Thanks website. I can't wait to that listen post. to that sweet soundtrack on repeat. Okay. Ooh. Over Ooh. two years ago, on our last Yacht Club Games Presents, we announced that we were working on new internal projects. Well, time flies, and we finally have something to share with you. Enjoy the presentation. What do you got? What do you got? Hold on, wait. Oh, it's a mouse! <laughs> okay. Bone chilling new adventure. Oh, he's so cute. Interesting. This is it looks a lot more like uh like Link uh Link's Awakening. And it also kind of reminds me of Panzer Paladin, both artistically and like I think the color palette too. It's kind of like a simplistic I don't know, there's like such a, like, there's two kinds of reds, there's two kinds of blues. That's not necessarily the back, but I'm trying to talk while being excited at the same time. I'm just rambling. This looks fun. It looks hard. What is this? Okay, so all the upgrades, I uh, collect all the items. Ooh, big pig. Ooh. Yo, some of these bosses look dope. Okay. Mina the Hollower. Now on Kickstarter. That looks dope. That looks cool. <laughs> so, Kickstarter, tell your friends about it. Yo. Absolutely. Oh, it's such cute art. Designer, Yacht Club Games, and director of Mina the Hollower. We're so excited to finally reveal this brand new project. Mina the Hollower is a bone-chilling action adventure featuring classic gameplay and an 8-bit aesthetic in the style of the Game Boy Color, but refined for the modern era. The game combines smooth 60 frames per second action combat, a world full of mystery and horror, and top-down I love adventures. these bosses, dude. As you might expect from the next this is cool designs. from our studio, Mina the Hollower is a celebration of games both old and new. You play as Mina, a whip-wielding Hollower and visionary inventor. She receives a troubling letter from Baron Lionel, her longtime patron and the overseer of Tenebrous Isle. Mina's advances in spark technology brought power to the island for the first time many years ago. But now, the spark generators have gone dark, and foul play is suspected. You'll use a myriad of weapons and oddball trinkets to vanquish the monsters thwarting Mina's objective. And along the way, you'll unearth the secret horror. There's some kind of weapon that like, looks like it freezes water, you can walk on it for like three spaces. Mina the Hollower is currently in the thick of production, and ideas are still taking form. We want your feedback, collaboration, and support in making Mina the Hollower the best game it can possibly be. That's why we're returning to our roots and kicking off Mina the Hollower's development as a Kickstarter campaign. For those of you who don't know, Kickstarter is a crowdfunding platform that allows communities to fund creators and bring so their visions cute, to life. Man. By backing That's awesome. Campaign, you can secure a copy of the game when it releases and PS5. even begin on the development process yourself. We've also partnered with Fangamer to create exclusive backer rewards, including a physical soundtrack, enamel pins, an art book, and even an adorable plush. Aww. Though we're financing a majority of the project ourselves, we hope we can create a more expansive game this way. More importantly, we want to build a community around Kickstarter, much like we did with Shovel Knight. We also want to share a development process more than That's ever so before. That's so cool. So join us for backer-exclusive development live streams. Help us flesh out Mina's adventure by contributing your ideas for enemies, NPCs, and boss designs. And learn about how we make games and join us on the journey. The Kickstarter is officially live right now. You can well, I'm going to have to go to the get art for the thumbnail. <laughs> Thank you so much for watching, and stick around because the party is going to continue alongside our hosts at G4 with an early preview of gameplay from Mina the Hollow. Oh, that's so dope. Thank you, that's Alec. So cool. That was awesome. As a massive fan of Shovel Knight and all of the amazing work being done by the Yacht Club Games team, I am so incredibly pumped 
for Mina the Hollower. And right after the break, we're going to be talking to some of the folks creating this new game, and we'll have the first ever world premiere gameplay demo of this brand new title right here on X-Play. We'll see you guys in just a moment. That's wild. Oh, I want that shovel and I push so bad. Oh, man. Yo. Oh, uh, that's awesome. That's super great. Like this, this was not something I necessarily, I went in with super high hopes to be like, they're going to show everything. Like, I, uh, I know back when they finished Shovel Knight or finished Shovel Knight, um, there were talks about like making a sequel, potentially going to the route of like Mario 64, um, whether that was an official quote or not, I don't know. But I was really just kind of like waiting to see what Yacht Club did next. And I was really excited for Cyber Shadow. Then I found out they were publishing it less than they were developing it, which either way, great game. Um, but seeing Mina, like that's a whole new game. I'm super excited to check out from them. Um, I'm sure that'll be years down the line before we get to see that. Um, but yeah, that's awesome. I'll definitely check out the Kickstarter, see uh, see what uh, rewards they have and what the development cycle looks like. But yeah, guys. That was the Yacht Club Presents for 2022. I hope you guys enjoyed my reaction. If you did, please do me a favor. Comment below what you thought of the presentation. What were you most excited about? Are you playing any Shovel Knight games? Cyber Shadow, etc., etc. You excited for Mina? Because I am. And if it's your first time checking out the content and you want to stick around and see some more, do yourself a favor. Hit the subscribe button and the notification bell. That we get notifications every time a new video comes out. And I'll see you guys next time.